Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to insert text in AutoCAD. It's very simple and there are two ways to do it. The first way I show you here is to insert a single line text. To do it, I will click in the arrow under the icon text and select single line text. If you cannot find it, you can also type with your keyword text. Ok, now I will click where I want to insert my text. The first thing, I have to specify the text height, which will correspond the size of this line. Then I will insert the direction of the text. I put an horizontal line because I want my text horizontal. I click and I can now type my text. As you see, it will be like the text above, but a little bit bigger. When I finish, I click with my mouse somewhere and then ask. Now, if I want to add text with the same size as this one, I click on my text, then right click in the blue square, go to quick properties, and here we can see the height of this text, which is 360. Now I close. So I will insert a new text, and this time I will type 360 for the text height to be exactly the same. So as you see now those two texts have the same size. Now I will show you a trick to add multiple titles with the same size. I type copy, select this text, type enter, click in the text and click again in the places where I want to copy it. As you see, this is very useful for floor plans. Now, when I finish, I just double click in each text to edit it. For example, this one, I write kitchen and I will continue doing this for all. OK, so the second way to add text is multi-line text. If I click in the same arrow, now I choose multi-line text or I can type with the keyboard M text or just T. Now this way will open a text box and I have to specify the horizontal range of the text. I can click here and now I can start writing. The multi-line text is better when we want to insert long text. In this tab we have all the options to edit our text and here we can change the text height. So it's all in this video. If you have enjoyed it, subscribe to watch the full list of AutoCAD tutorials. And also you will be notified with the new updates. So thank you very much for watching and see you next time.